you guys and welcome back to my channel today's video is gonna be a little different all right i've been like really tired of wearing the blonde wig because it's such a bold hair to wear like a bold color to wear one and then i feel like you have to be dressed up at all times to wear it now i can dress up at all times but honestly i have not been feeling good lately i don't know if y'all can hear it in my voice but I've, i have not been feeling good so um even right now i'm gonna try my hardest to do what i'm trying to do for real but um i have been wanting to just go back black for a while um as far as like hair color and stuff like that so the wig is off the wig is actually sitting on my desk over here i'm gonna show y'all <laughs> yeah if i go like oh why like why you don't have it up um, I literally just wore it out to the store, so I just tossed it and threw it right there with a bold-ass pink hat. I don't know why, but anyway, so I had this wig that I installed on myself a while back. Today's also my husband's birthday, so I did like a little quarantine <laughs> birthday party. But anyway, um, I have this wig that I'm going to revamp um, and uh, get it back together. Uh, it's a lot of glue and nasty stuff on it, so I'm going to soak it and... Um, you know clean it and revamp it i'm gonna soak my wig and show you all the process of me turning this wig back into a a bad queen because i think i'm really just ready to not be so bold um it still look cute so i'm gonna install this wig onto my head after i clean it out because this is disgusting <laughs> i'm gonna dump this wig just like this dump it in there right put some hot water on like it's really sticky my hands are so gross um but yeah i'm gonna stick it in here let the water get hot all over the bucket all right like i said i'm gonna do the shampoo now i don't really use the shampoo like that but since i have it i'm using it for my wigs this is what it looks like y'all um I'm kind of just mixing it up just so I can make sure that the um, the lace part isn't sticking. This water is extremely hot, so I really got to watch out what I'm doing. But um, yeah, I want to make sure the lace is getting hit. As y'all can see, all that gunk. Uh, we're definitely going to get that up out of there. So it's literally the next day, guys. Um, I left this in overnight because yesterday, like I said, was my husband's birthday and... I really didn't have time and what he wanted for his birthday was to spend time with us so that's what we did so um the hair i just let soak overnight and as you can see like i tried like a little piece and it's literally lifting up like it's the stocking cap even though it's not the stocking cap but it's just coming up like you know easy so i'm gonna use like a a knife um a plastic knife and just kind of scrape it Just clean the water out that had the um, shampoo in it, and I just filled it up with extremely hot water. I now have my deep conditioner that I'm about to use inside of this. So yeah, let's do that real quick. I'm gonna open it up. This water's so hot, y'all. I'm probably using way too much, but the, I just love how this smells. So I'm just gonna let it sit now again. After this, I'm gonna take it out and um and do like I think one more rinse, and then I'm gonna take it out and blow it out and stuff like that for you guys to see and we're just going to do it all together now the lace it's not as clean as i want it especially right here um so i was trying like the the back in the day method to kind of like take it and just scrub it to get it to come off so i just throw my my daughter back say hey okay so um from before y'all saw you know how bad the lace was why this is cut right here probably messed up but um this is how good i was able to get the lace i'm gonna give y'all like a real good close-up of how good i was or how you know how good i was able to um clean it you know this is my first time cleaning it so um yeah what do y'all think 
Also, this is my first time cleaning it with the glue on it. I've washed wigs, but just to have like glue stuck on it, I didn't know. And this glue has been sitting on um, this head for quite a while. This is what it's looking like now. I just have it inside out so that the cap could air dry. So I'm just gonna leave this for a while. This video is probably not gonna go up today, probably tomorrow, just because it's wet. And I wanna make sure that this is dry and then the, the other side is dry. So I'm probably gonna leave it overnight, but yeah guys let me know what you think so far i'm gonna do a straight wig this time this create this wig i got curly but um well not curly but like i got it curled when i got it first installed but now i'm just gonna straighten it because i feel like straight is my look for right now what do you think yeah yeah so yeah we're gonna do straight um i also look very bummy today so please don't mind me again like i said i sound and and feel sick good morning like I said, it's the next day. Um, I decided to let the hair air dry, well, the roots air dry overnight. So this is how the wig is looking. So I'm gonna show you guys what the lace is looking like. This is the lace. Now I know the lighting isn't the best right now, but you can still see I cleaned it really good. Um, the hair smells amazing. So now I'm just gonna straighten it and um, I'm gonna apply it on later. Like I'm gonna put it on me later. But right now I'm just trying to show you guys how I revamped it from it looking crazy. I had took a whole I took a whole nap yesterday, and it was difficult for me to take that nap because I couldn't even breathe. Like right now. Um, again, it's not COVID. I'm just I'm just under the weather. I just finished the wig. Like I said, I'm gonna install it later. Hopefully if I'm feeling good, but this is how it turned out after I flat ironed it um, Straight so the part is like a Kind of like a curved part. I usually go for a, um, a side part just because I don't like um, Not I don't like my forehead. I like my forehead, but if I do a middle part my forehead be uh It's usually out here. So I'm trying not to trying to cover it up with some, some hair you know um also i'll flick the baby hairs down later and cut it a little bit more because i feel like they're long um and yeah so let me know what y'all think down below in the comment section about this video was it helpful um will you be trying it out with your wigs uh i know it was a little crazy but you know we got it done so i'm proud of that and i can't wait to wear it and it really really smells good so if you don't have the products that i have um you know use what you have but yeah that's it i'm not gonna do too much rambling uh if you want more tips on how to um you know wash or style or um just wig care at all let me know down in the comment section and yeah i got you see you guys in my next video peace out